Art is creativity and a way to express yourself. Art is the creative expression of who we are. Art is the thing that can lead to the soundtrack of your life. Art is an extension of someone's soul. It's a, it's a way for them to allow everything that's inside of them, what they're feeling, what they're seeing, um, to become real so everybody else can experience it. Students come to us on field trip experiences and they have a chance to look at the art, to talk about the art, and also to create their own artwork. All of these programs inspire different life skills, everything from confidence to problem solving, self-expression. We see approximately 1,200 to 2,000 students a year, running everywhere from pre-K students all the way up to seniors in high school, and from every school here in our community. Bringing music into schools is critical right now because there's people in this country trying to build walls, and I think music is about building bridges. When you hear music, it doesn't matter the language, like it cuts deep and I think brings people together. Kids are told what to do every day, all day. Um, but kids also have a spirit and a soul that hasn't been tamed. And we forget as adults the authority that kids have or young people have in their own life, in their own right, and that they have the ability to dream in the way that that us as adults have forgotten how to do. The value of stages every time our teachers go into the classroom, I think the thing that we experience is that children get to learn without right, wrong, or pass, fail. It's the most liberating way for anyone, not just kids, to learn. One particular memory is as, as a classroom was being taken out of the gym, the teacher yelled back and said, hey, tell him, pointed to a kid and said, hey, tell him what you just told me. And this little boy turned around and said, this is the best day of my life ever. And, and to see that from otherwise maybe sheltered or um, shy kids start coming alive is so rewarding. It allows us to collaborate one-on-one -on -one with teachers in their classrooms, and these aren't art classrooms. Based on these wonderful relationships that we already have with the teachers and the schools in our community, we're able to work one-on-one -on -one in these classrooms. So whether it's a history class, a math class, the teacher invites us in, and it's pure collaboration. We bring the art project, the teacher brings the curriculum, and then the kids bring the creativity and the willingness to participate. Student matinees are pretty cool because more often than not, those are the shows where you have kids who have never seen a live stage performance before and essentially it's magic. Um, if, you, if you get a chance to hear, uh, usually we do a talk back at the end. They have just these wonderful, joyous, uh, sometimes naive but beautiful questions um, about this art form that they've never experienced before. Finally, I'd just like to give a really big thank you to everybody at the center and even more so all you guys, all the donors and people supporting this program. Um, without you, it would not be possible for me to go study photography for a week or two in a different part of the U.S. It's inspired me to go to college for a very specific purpose and talking to my peers and people who have gone through the center um, with scholarships and working with them, they always reference it as being a huge, um, impactful thing in their life. So thanks again. Thank you, Sun Valley Center for the Arts, for all the opportunities you've given me.